Well, let me introduce you now to the poached egg. I know from experience that a 7-0 needle is jolly difficult to pick up and manipulate on a wet, sticky surface. So I thought to myself, what do we have in the kitchen that could simulate a wet, sticky surface? The poached egg came to mind. Now, the reason why this is very useful is because the membrane of the yolk is very thin and simulates a thin coral vessel. In this exercise, we are going to make an incision in the membrane of the yolk. And we're going to practice rotating the needle through the simulated arteriotomy with a clean entry in and a clean entry out without scrambling the yolk. You think I'm yoking, don't you? Haha, <laughs> boom, boom. This is very difficult, but it's going to teach you lightness of touch. It'll teach you rotation. It'll give you instant feedback if your rotation is actually clumsy, if you drag your needle in or drag your needle out. You'll find that you start scrambling the egg. I have to laugh to myself. Some of my trainees have actually asked, how do I poach an egg? Well, I'll leave that for later, but let's focus on stitching this egg. Gosh. Even at my stage, I find poached eggs a challenge. And it's funny, I'm just thinking to myself, as I'm concentrating, picking this needle up carefully, without tearing the tissue, I, I don't appear to be able to complete a sentence or talk. Just tore it there for a moment. Now I'm going to pick it up again cleanly. A line for the heel with my needle parallel to the toe walls. Use the belly to push the posterior wall away. Slide it up through the anterior wall and pick it up for the next stitch. You might hear the castor has been locked and unlocked. It's locked as I take the needle away, but unlocked as I introduce the needle into the arteriotomy. You'll find that that will actually remove the unnecessary movement. It's becoming a little bit of a challenge now because the egg yolk is drying on the end of my castors. But I hope you can appreciate that you do have to be delicate and gentle with the rotation of the needle.